All right, guys. Everyone tells you how to get modded. I started out on the wrong screen. But first, you're gonna go into your matrix settings. I gotta go back. <laughs> We're all fucking awful. Okay. First, in order, you you got your typical mods, and I'm gonna show you how to make it actually look cool instead of just having this shit because most people don't understand why matrix is better. First, you're gonna go into this. You're gonna set your theme option, which I had a custom theme, enable custom theme. And then you're going to reset, which this makes it better because when you open up something or a conversation or something, you have this background when you don't have to have your image enabled and you see how it all changes. Now I got my blue and green theme. And also, we're going to go over bubble colors before I show you the theme. You want to enable this if you want to see other people's bubble couple in this. And then you're going to set your bubble color yours. You're going to have to go pay attention to the colors. It'll start out like black. It'll start out actually like black with that. And you'll go this way to adjust the brightness. This way for transparency. Okay. So if you want a transparent bubble, you're going to put it all the way over here. So you won't be able to see it. Even if you pick any color, you won't be able to see it. Okay, if you just want a special color, like a bit darker. Transparency is not really going to work because you want to see your text. But if you want a darker green, or like, you can play with it, you know, just find what you like. Same with the text color and your bubble shape. If you have a transparent bubble, you won't need that. And if you want to see other people's bubble color, you want to have these two enabled. It won't work if you have paranoid enabled. So same with the text option. You'll pick your text option. Rainbow is blinding. You can use it if you like it right here okay so you got all this you're gonna pick your color and dummy color so in order to set up the bot this is where we're getting into okay so we're gonna go get into this stuff okay well not working we're gonna go get into this stuff uh loading okay let me find some random group hmm. hashtag lolke create lolke lol okay so basically you're going to type bot and it should pop up with the command so you're going this is how you enable you type bot to add responses you're going to enable them for that chat and it should work if you don't have pre-chat enabled if you have it enabled it should be conversation from conversation and you would have to enable them to add a response which the response works actually really well contains like if you put lit even if it's just something with okay in it, it will say whatever the fuck you say. Say it. Okay. And yeah, yeah, the equal is only if that exact word or phrase is typed. The B, the blacklist words actually work. So res word restriction. If you enable them, it would be like word restriction enabled. And you can choose to ban someone or remove them from this. So if it's like, okay... And it works like if you say one phrase or you got a whole phrase, it's not. If that phrase is said in a paragraph or something, it's not going to remove them. Only if they say that one phrase. Like if someone keeps repeating some stupid shit, put it on that list. Okay, chat games is one of the best. So in order to do chat games, you would have to enable games for this chat. And they can, and anyone in your group can actually type these. Like type. And you got your game. Okay, not gonna go for it. But in case you get stuck on a game, you just type in bot again. And you're gonna go word game and you're gonna go reset game. Like even with scramble, you're gonna go, okay, clipboard. You're gonna go type in bot again. And you're gonna go to game and you're gonna go reset. There's no game running, yada yada. That's how you reset the game if someone had it running. And that's basically how you use the bot system. The OP system is still the same. If you need help with that, check out my day video. Actually, no. If you need help with that, just request it in the comments. And I'll get to you as soon as I can. But you are welcome to join this group. I mean, I'm, not, I'm probably not going to fuck with it. So... That's how you use the bot system and that's how you make your matrix look cool like that.
You pick your theme color, your foreign color, which changes the background instead of you being limited to black and white. This makes it work well right here, guys. And like, if you message me and you have matrix, you'll be able to see my text color. If you have those global settings enabled, it's not going to work if you have paranoid mode on. So that's a little fun note. But download Matrix 3. I'll leave another link in the description. Oh, let me type this shit. It's like info. And guys, okay. I've been also meaning to mention. Mention. Okay, wait. I'm, I've been. Like, you have music in this. And it's actually really good. It's not that bad. It's like, listen. And it should stop. As you're seeing it stopped. And there's the website guys. I'll copy this right quick and put it in the description. You can join their groups. They're very helpful. And I mean it's all together. One, like, one of the best modded kits ever. Alright guys. Everyone tells you how to get modded. I started out on the wrong screen. But first you're going to go into your matrix settings. I got to go back. <laughs> We're all fucking awful. Okay. First, in order, you, you got your typical mods, and I'm going to show you how to make it actually look cool. Instead of just having this shit, because most people don't understand why Matrix is better. First, you're going to go into this. You're going to set your theme option, which I had a custom theme. Enable custom theme. And then you're going to reset, which this makes it better, because when you open up something, or a conversation or something... You have this background when you don't have to have your image enabled. And you see how it all changes. Now I got my blue and green theme. And also, we're going to go over bubble colors before I show you the theme. You want to enable this if you want to see other people's bubble couple in this. And then you're going to set your bubble color yours. You're going to have to go pay attention to the colors. It'll start out like black. It'll start out actually like black with that. And you'll go this way to adjust the brightness. This way for transparency. Okay, so if you want a transparent bubble, you're going to put it all the way over here, so you won't be able to see it. Even if you pick any color, you won't be able to see it. Okay, if you just want a special color, like a bit darker, transparency is not really going to work because you want to see your text. But if you want a darker green, or like, you can play with it, you know, just find what you like. Same with the text color and your bubble shape. If you have a transparent bubble, you won't need that. And if you want to see other people's bubble color, you want to have these two enabled. It won't work if you have paranoid enabled. So same with the text option. You'll pick your text option. Rainbow is blinding. You can use it if you like it. Right here. Okay, so you got all this. You're going to pick your color, incoming color. So in order to set up the bot, this is where we're getting into. Okay. So we're going to go get into this stuff. Okay, well, not working for me right now. Okay. So we're going to go get into this stuff. Uh, loading. Okay. Let me find some random group. Hmm. Hashtag L-O-L-K-E. Create L-O-L-K-E. Okay. So basically, you're going to type bot. And it should pop up with the command. So... You're going, this is how you enable it. You type bot to add responses. You're going to enable them for that chat. And it should work if you don't have pre-chats enabled. If you have it enabled, it should be conversation from conversation. And you would have to enable them to add a response. Which the response works actually really well. Contains like if you put lit. Even if it's just something with okay in it. It will say whatever the fuck you say. Say it. Okay. And yeah, yeah, the equal is only if that exact word or phrase is type. The B, the blacklist words actually work. So res word restriction. If you enable them, it would be like word restriction enabled. And you can choose to ban someone or remove them from this. So if it's like, okay, and it works. Like if you say one phrase or you got a whole phrase, it's not if that phrase is said in a paragraph or something it's not going to remove them only if they say that one phrase like if someone keeps repeating some stupid shit put it on that list okay chat games is one of the best so in order to do chat games 
you would have to enable games for this chat and they can and anyone in your group can actually type these like type and you got your game okay not gonna go for it but in case you get stuck on a game you just type in bot again and you're gonna go word game and you're gonna go reset game like even with scramble you're gonna go okay clipboard you're gonna go type in bot again and you're gonna go to game and you're gonna go reset there's no game running yada yada that's how you reset the game if someone had it running and that's basically how you use the bot system the OP system is still the same if you need help with that check out my day video actually no I, if you need help with that just request it in the comments and I'll get to you as soon as I can but you are welcome to join this group I mean I'm not I'm probably not gonna fuck with it so that's how you use the bot system and that's how you make your matrix look cool like that you pick your theme color your foreign color which changes the background instead of you being limited to black and white this makes it work well right here guys and like if you message me and you have matrix you'll be able to see my text color if you have those global settings enabled it's not going to work if you have paranoid mode on so that's a little fun note but download matrix 3 i'll leave another link in the description oh, let me type this shit it's like info and guys okay i've been also meaning to mention mention okay wait I'm, i've been like you have music in this and it's actually really good it's not that bad it's like listen and it should stop as you're seeing it stopped and there's the website guys I'll copy this right quick and put it in the description you can join their groups they're very helpful and I mean it's all together the one like one of the best modded kits ever 